Welcome back. Let's continue with our full course in AutoCAD for Mechanical Engineering. This is lesson number 10. In uh, this lesson, we'll just make some uh, practice and uh, try to put in practice what we have learned so far. We'll make this uh, coupling. So we have the coupling here in uh, two different uh, position. And uh, this coupling, that's the one that we'll, uh, we'll make. We have here the same one with the uh, dimension. So. Okay, so we have here 40 and here is uh, uh, 60. So let's 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 start and make the drawing. We'll use for this drawing pull line. Just click my pull line. Here we have 40. And also here is uh, 40. And then we have 10. And then we have let's let's check. So from here to here, from here to here is 60. I'm gonna have here 60. And then I'm gonna have here the angle. Uh, okay, this one here is also 60. And here I can use the arc. All right, so that's the arc, 60. And then I go back to line. Then I'm continue here, 60 again, and then 10. Okay, now I can close. Right. Next step, we'll be making this circle here. This circle, that's the dimension, 30 diameter. Come here to make my diameter 30 next step so this one is a pull line we just explode to separate line so it's done now i can use the offsets and make that this difference is four just put here four enter and then copy my line done Next step is making here these fillets, the radius is 6, we have seen is 6, just come here, the put there 6, enter again, so 6, and then done. Okay, next step is making, let's see, here says there is a, this angle 30 degree so we are right there just activate line and then put 30 30 mean that uh, we have 90 degree plus 30 would would uh, will be 120 so in this case will just be put 20 and 120 degree 19 plus 30 is 120 degree so that's okay and then Repeat the command to do also to decide the same thing 20, 1, 20 degree. All right, now I can use trim to delete the lines that I don't want. All right. So, I think here this part is complete. Now I'm gonna do this part. So this part here, we can see the same dimension. Let's, let's, let's go and make these other parts. Okay, again a pull line to make sure that we start the same dimension. We just start here and then we just use the uh, uh, or to mode to make sure that we have straight line and then also here all right and then i'm gonna go 10 40 also 40 again 40 10 and then here same side from here 
this stage 19 right in here the check so we have from the middle 30 which means that uh, from here to here is 15 right because here we have 60 30 the difference is 15 and then I'm gonna have here 15 and then we have there 70 70 and then 30 in the middle all right something 30 70 and then you can just close okay next step he's making let's go we have also this uh, no this you can see from the other side here this gonna make just cop the line from the bottom one. just go there to the line and use line here and then the cop all right this one here just cop this one okay all right to the top make sure if they are all activated okay we have quadrant recession perpendicular okay now they are now all right okay here there and can again continue the command here there and again gonna have this side, this side, and again, this side, this side, and two. Next step will be making our hatch to this side here. So we'll choose this one, click, okay, done. And then uh, I'm gonna make also the same thing here. So this is a pull line, I will just explode. And then offset so the four is already there just copy here and then make something as we have done below just activate the auto mode we have here 120 something to, to this side 120 now can activate print and then all right so my drawing is almost done just finish one more thing the fillet 10 just here fillets radio gonna put here 10 multiple all right and then this side here okay so the drawing is done as you can see here is a coupling and uh, we can make sure that uh, they have the same size by make the dimension here you can make the dimension so linear from this side to this side can see 30 and also from this side to this side you can see the 60 and also the angle uh, from this to this side you can see here 30 you can see and that's uh, pretty much what 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 we we have done so the, the radius this side you can see is 10 so they are complete uh, according to our drawing so just put the last one here this this okay and then uh, 
the other one is from here to here is four so that's pretty much what we have done and th thank you very much for watching let's go to the next uh, uh, practice practice